How long can you hold your breath underwater? Long enough to kick your butt afterwards. <laughs> the amazing Rando! Watch Rando the Great construct sets with his very mind! <laughs> What's up, rascals? Welcome back to the Watson Scott test. We are about to get underway with more of it to see how much of a scaredy pants baby man it tries to make me and uh, see what my greatest fears are. We are about to continue with the quiz test thingy and away we go. How far is the closest police station? Why are you... This is a specific... Oddly specific question. And yes, it is more than a 15-minute walk. Okay, that's uncomfortable. The screaming in the, uh, in the background is a little unsettling. How well do you know your neighbors? Uh, we're acquaintances. I don't really converse with them too much. So, I, I'm, I'm a private person at home. How long can you hold your breath underwater? Long enough to kick your butt afterwards. Uh, why specifically 41 seconds do you ask this question here? Maybe there's some science to it that I'm not remembering or knowing or something. I don't know. 41 seconds. Why 41 seconds? You come home late one night to find your front door wide open and the lock smashed to the to pieces. The first thing you do is well, I'd probably call the police because uh Yeah, the screaming is getting a little bit louder. The the background noises they're they're like Really amping it up little by little. It's kind, it's kind of creepy. That's the idea. And that door squeak was on the wrong side of the room for me, so it didn't freak me out one bit. Anyway, I would call the police because that's the first thing you should do and you think there has been an intruder. So, poopy poopy. You and your second closest friend are stranded on a remote desert island after your plane crashed in the ocean. The nearest ship can help you with the nearest ship that can help you will arrive in one week you have one more day of food and water before you will both die of starvation there is no other food around oh oh now we're getting into morality are we okay murder my second closest friend out of boredom and wait then wait to die Wait until the food runs out and then murder my second closest friend out of spite. Ration the food and attempt to survive against all odds. Walk ceremoniously into the ocean and drown. Well, I'm not a big fan of uh, deliberately killing myself. And I'm not the kind of person that would hold malice against somebody like that in a survival situation. It's not nice. And you're more likely to survive together than you would alone, so I would ration the food because there is no way I'm going to yeah, well murder is no I'm not doing that, no I will now show you an image please study it the image will not speak Okay, the first image didn't move. This one doesn't speak. Why? Why do we need to worry about that? That spider is missing some legs. How did that image make you feel? None of these! Made me curious, if anything. So, uh, I'll just go ahead and say that. I don't know. I'll ask this one more time. Are you playing a game right now? 
Interesting. I am curious. And I'm going to go ahead and say yes, just to see what the reaction is. Do you know that I'm a good person? No, I don't. In fact, your questioning is making me very suspicious of you. Are you lying to me right now? No, I am not. Are you lying to me? Lying is forbidden. <laughs> Excuse me. That's rude. Please select any of the following sports that you have played. Oh. Oh, that's... Which one? Because I have actually done most of these. Surprise, surprise! I can do the karate death chop. What was the last one I actually did? Uh, I'll go with I'll go with that. So, please select any of the following industries that you have occupational experience with. Okay. Um, yeah, none of the above. Can't say that I have any experience in any of those. Do you think I can tell when you're lying? Probably not, so I'm going to go ahead and say that. Choose the word that is most similar to appropriate. I'm sorry, what?! None of these! Wait! This is the... Wait, okay, okay, okay. Depends on your context of the word appropriate. So if... So if you're thinking murder, that's... In a, if you're thinking murder is appropriate, you're just sick in the head. Innocence, that... That can be appropriate, but... Let's go ahead. Babies, babies are appropriate. They are good and innocent and right in the world. So, I'm just going to use that as my answer because I don't know what else to do. <laughs> Your recent answers indicate you are exhibiting a fight or flight response and may be at risk of acute stress reaction. I'll need you to breathe slowly and calm down. Press continue when you are calm. Only when you are calm. This is interesting, but you're wrong, because I'm not real. Maybe I'm doing a fight or flight thing, and it's in my subconscious, and I don't realize I'm doing it. But I am actually quite calm, so I'm going to continue, because what else am I going to do? I'm a, well, I could take a break, but no need right now. Please take a moment to look away from your monitor and observe the nearest exit. Make sure you could run if something were to happen to you. Do this now. More or less. Did you look away from your screen? Yes. Oh, fuck you is an answer. Oh, that's cute. Oh, you're adorable. <laughs> Do you think I can tell when you look away from your screen? No, I don't think so, but... Oh, you're not going to give me much choice, are you? Alright, fine. I'll play this game. Third answer, because poo-poo. You remember those uh, multiple choice questions that you get with the bubble sheet and all that shit in school? Yeah, that's that's what that situation was. Do you feel safe in your house right now? I like the lack of choice that you're giving me now. Unsure. I don't need to worry about whether I'm safe in my house. Are you having fun? I'm going to go ahead and say unsure because I'm starting to get kind of a... Uh, what's, the, what's, the, what's, what, what's the term I'm thinking of? It's like... The fact that it's not giving me an actual choice right now to to actually choose my own response is kind of triggering a defiance uh, 
trait in my personality. And so I'm like, I'm kind of like getting uh, a bit aggressive right now. Well, I didn't read that. Please ignore any external sim stimulus. Concentrate only on this screen. There are no unexpected guests in your house. There are no unusual sounds coming from inside your house. Do not take your eyes off the screen. Do you understand? Yes. Yes, I understand. So I will not take my eyes off the screen. Here we go. Liar. Do you understand? I didn't lie. You're being a bitch. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? I like how they're trying to do the whole ambient sound thing in the headphones. That's kind of cool. Spooky. Test complete. Thank you for participating. Your results are being processed. I survived the Watson Scott test. Are you done? I was expecting that 15 minutes ago. <laughs> when I see a cat holding a dead mouse, I feel proud. Yes, I do. Most afraid of going to jail for a crime I didn't commit. Well, I suppose that could be true of anybody, really. I mean, if you're completely innocent, why would you want to go to jail? Nobody wants to go to jail. Even people who have committed crimes don't want to go to jail. So to be jailed for something you know you didn't do, that's kind of bullshit. The main test is complete. There is a bonus test available. Would you like to take it? I could technically click maybe another time. Because we're going to end the episode right here. Thank you guys so much for watching this. Sorry it didn't get me jump scared like, the, like somebody thought it would. <laughs> ah, that's probably going to be the most anticlimactic thing for everyone watching. And I, I apologize for that. But I was actually kind of expecting it with all the sounds going on. And uh, so... Poo poo! Anyway, I hope you guys liked this. If you did, let me know by giving that like button a bop. Leave some comments down below. And if you've taken this test, let me know how you did. And I will see you in the next video. Hopefully, it'll amaze. Mm -hmm.